What is up everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Video Games and today we're still with Michael here. Um, I'm gonna take him to ammunition real quick because I'm just gonna keep forgetting to give him new guns if I don't do this right now. So we're gonna do that real quick and then my plan is to switch over to Franklin and kind of hang out with him a little bit today um, and maybe get some more Trevor action as well because the both of them have a good amount of missions in this area so we'll be able to explore that together. But, man, do I have some news for you guys. So in case if you somehow missed what happened um, a couple of days ago, <laughs> and it's just, this is so hard for me to talk about because, like, I'm still in shock <laughs> by it. Um, but basically, I just hop on my YouTube, like, earlier in the day, um, and tell me how I see, like this notification and someone's like oh hey like just letting you know that ned luke mentioned your youtube account on his twitter and i was like no way like that's a lie right like oh, that's a lie right and i just didn't want to believe it at first I, I was like let me hop on twitter real quick which i never do i'm usually never on twitter but i just had to at this very moment and so i looked and sure enough yep he posted my my channel on his twitter and so i'm like Oh, hold on. Steve's calling. DeSanta. Interrupting my That's moment. Not the name your file, Michael. Steve Haynes here. Yeah, Agent Douchebag. Hey, that poor son of a bitch we grabbed for you still breathing? See for yourself right now. Trevor Phillips is on his way to help with the debrief. Warehouse off Dutch London and Banning. Great. Sounds just like my kind of party. Oh, won't you look at that? Now we actually have a mission with Michael. Yeah, we'll do that. We will definitely do that. I'm excited. Um. But anyway, so yeah, I, man, I got so excited. I like called up my friend and I was like, oh my God, you, you like, you will not believe what just happened. Ned just posted me on his fucking Twitter and I was just not believing it. I was, I was already like, I was so excited and we're like screaming on this phone call and I'm just so hyped and I'm like hyperventilating a little bit and I'm like, oh my God. And then, so I realized as well that Ned commented on my YouTube video. And I'm like, holy shit, like this is just, this is a lot unfolding in a time span of like not even 10 minutes here. And so I'm like replying, I replied to his comment and then I saw that he's actually live on YouTube. So I was like, oh my God, all right, let me hop on this live real quick and let's see what's going on. And you know, like a minute passes and then all of a sudden I just hear him, he's like, yeah, like I've, I've been watching this new streamer and her name's Kaylee and you know, she's like basically doing what I'm doing right now and she's doing a whole playthrough and like I've been watching it and you should go over and check her out and give her a sub. At this point, I'm just like, I'm floating. He definitely, he knows who I am. <laughs> Ned, if you happen to be watching this video, hey, welcome back. Um, we love you so much. Thank you for being you. I'm kind of scared to keep playing this game now. <laughs> I'm like, I just, I don't know. It's it's like just such a crazy feeling because starting a YouTube channel has like been one of my lifelong goals, like especially growing up. Like I've always been, if not recording stuff, editing videos. Like I always knew this was, I wanted to do something around that realm. And I've always loved gaming. The fact that my channel has just been growing so fast because of this game, it just feels so surreal. And the fact that the Ned Luke knows that I exist is a very crazy feeling. And I am just so grateful, very thankful to even like have these opportunities and chances to show the love that I have towards gaming and share my experiences with such a wholesome community. Like I'm just, thank you to everyone really for getting me to where I am right now. I mean, this is just the beginning and it just feels so insane in the best way possible. The year just started and I already know that this is gonna be one of the best highlights of my year, if not the best highlight of my year. Thank you guys so much. So anyway, with that being said, now we actually do have some action with Michael, but okay. So I know there's like technically a mission prompted. Can I? Can I at least stock up real quick on on some stuff here? It's also trying to prompt me to switch over to Trevor. So should I do that or can I stay as Michael? That's the real question. A heavy pistol? You have good taste. I, can tell. I don't know, I feel like... Okay, these uh, melee weapons are pretty oh, cheap. Around, huh? We don't have any melee going on here. We're just, we're all about this gun action. I want the antique dagger, if anything. 
Why not? Oh, you can... Oh, I'm so glad I just bought this. I did not know you could customize it. It's kind of expensive, though. Hate with jewels. Or love with jewels. Oh my god, that's fucking awful. Yeah, let's just stab them real quick. I mean, if I were to get one, I think I would get this one. Let's be real. I'm gonna wait on that, though. Sawed off shotgun. We don't even have the micro. Oh my god. You can really deck this one out. Put a scope on it. You know what? I am gonna do... Let's do suppressors on those, because why not? Heavy sniper. Oh, he doesn't have any snipers yet. It's just Trevor. Wait, which one do I want? We'll start with this one for now. That's fine. Okay, hold on. Hmm. Hmm. I gotta get him a grenade launcher now. Ooh, should we give it a tint? Can I make it pink? <laughs> Am I allowed? Are you guys gonna make fun of me? Deer urine, jeez. Okay. I mean, gold tint is really cool too. Or I could be doing green for some of these guns. I do like green. Oh, wait, 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 guys. How am I forgetting about the sticky bombs already? That's insane. We'll start with 10, I guess. Tear gas? I don't know. Who knows when I'm gonna need it? I don't know what's about to go down. Okay, that's that's a good start, I think. I guess I'm switching over to Trevor. That's what it's telling me to do, so I think I need to do that. <laughs> I guess. But I just wanted to get guns for Michael first. He needs it. He's like the only- he's the one who had the least amount of guns. Is he seriously shitting? Sweet. <laughs> Why? <Jesus. laughs> Why? Oh, the hell are you doing? Please. Oh, nothing. Are you taking a dump? Oh, why do you He's got some class. He's doing it behind the dumpster, guys. You. Uh, I got abandonment issues. I see a shrink once a week. You know, fuck you. Yeah, well, you know. It's so funny. Nothing like meeting a bunch of creeps from the government in a quiet building for someone to grow balls. See his face that last time I popped it. <laughs> Boom! Oh, ladies! God, you're an asshole. Really, though? You, you back there. I know you, but you? You, I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Uh huh. Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, Trevor, he's got that fist ready. It reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> hey! Devin Is he Weston? wrong though? Not really. A very good friend that was of very mine. accurate. Why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something. That guy gets more tail than uh, <laughs> than a tail catcher. <laughs> I have to fucking remember that line. <laughs> that was you. so funny, dude. You're doing Where did great. We meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh, what are we doing here, huh? This. Please. Keep the sleep best of the way from me. No, oh, no, no, Ferdinand, he's gone. No. He's gone. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael, and this, this is Trevor. No. Now our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know, I already told nothing. Nothing, I don't know anything. Please, please, sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis? Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, hi-fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price, VIP. No? I don't spy. like this. <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. So I need to know. Fuck. What did you tell them? And what did they tell you? Hmm? I, I told them what I tell you. Uh-huh. Is that a lie detector? Uh, hey. This whoa, 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 what is this? The house in Our... Rockwood Hills. Wait. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. 
I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You two I, are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. Because no, 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 I'm tired of these fucking nitwits at the agency taking all the glory. Let me go. Hey, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know, go for a drive. What? You get to work, and uh, I'm not here. God damn. Okay, not a lie detector. Definitely not. Damn. I bet you that man is wishing he was just having that big old stick up his asshole right now instead of this shit. All of a sudden, he's wishing that lube was grabbed. The more I see your boss, the more I like it. If I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh well, boo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. Yeah. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. <laughs> does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us... Oh, really? Before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush. One of them spent 10 years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or... Or... We stumbled on the cash depot job. Brad went down, you went down. Trevor got away. The FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to I'm, say which of those is true? I mean, that one's kind of believable. Doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away. The second he saw you. You remember mm -hmm. after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Town. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. I don't know. Okay, this so... Is bullshit. This place. Oh, God, what is this? Davey, they've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. <laughs> no way that's your guy. Shit. You need anything? You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. That is hilarious. What a show title, folks. Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Yeah, we don't need to be silencing multiple people here for no reason. Okay? Hey, you want a coffee? Can I get you anything? Hell yeah, I want a coffee. Out, that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work What the fuck? Where do you start, eh, buddy? Wait. What are you talking about, the wrong guy? You circle oh, to view Mr. K's want? health and heart rate? Just tell me what you if Mr. K's pushed too far, he may need an internal and shot. Look at me, please. Uh, uh, Come on, we haven't broken him yet. I don't know, this look, one's big. Look, <laughs> God damn. Please don't hit me. I don't it's want to. So it's heavy. Trevor that wants to. I know, I did pick, like, one of the biggest ones, didn't I? He didn't. He fucking didn't. Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tahir Javan. Why didn't you ask me? I know Tahir. I did his whole, whole theater. He lives in Chumash, right into the Western Highway. Oh. That wasn't so tough, was it? Huh? <laughs> Did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash, the Western Highway. This is fucking insane. Yeah. Chumash. Okay. You're driving. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. <laughs> well, at least y'all did have your coffee break. That is insane. Okay. Hit 
Hit you up on the life invader. Hell no. Seems like a productive relationship. Well, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of it. Then what? This thing with the agency gets put to rest, and we don't need you anymore. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job. No casualties. There were more eyes on that town than there needed to be. Yeah, hmm. well, according to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those what? fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad. Who he thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael. That's so the sad! Right. It's a good exercise. What the fuck? The, he has the trainees write a the few fucking years letters. Ago, a letter came to the federal prison system addressed to Brad. It wasn't signed, but it gave a P.O. box in Sandy Shores. I played the part of Brad and we started a correspondence. Yeah, thanks for telling me, Davey. I was doing you a favor. Didn't think you want to know he was in the same state. Yeah, so now what? I just sit back and hope he doesn't figure it out? It's worked so far. He's a time bomb, Dave, and you fucking know it. You know what? All of a sudden, I'm this really on Trevor's time side time. right now. Really on Trevor's side. That is fucked. Okay. This'll do. Ooh. All right. Kind of a cozy spot. Find right out who we're looking for. Yeah, we need the description of the target. Yeah, uh, I'll take care of it. Loosen him up. Oh, no, no, please. Again? What? What you Loosen him up. No, please. I gotta pick a new weapon. Jesus Christ. Break him, Mr. Phillips. Not the jumpers. My arm. You can't. Not the clips. Turn him off. <laughs> Not that. No, no, no. Is he okay? Do Is he okay? Don't run him completely. Ah! I'm gonna jump in his pants. <laughs> I'm getting scared. I don't want to accidentally hey, kill him hey, or anything. Hey, hey. Now? Huh? Now? You ready to talk? I've been ready to talk since the day I got kidnapped six weeks That's ago. That's what we were afraid of. No, I mean, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk. This guy we're after, what does he look like? Average build. Come on. Average height. Middle age. Yeah, yeah. It sounds like you're stalling. This better be hair. enough. Middle age, middle height, middle no, build, whatever. He's dark. So okay, he's Azerbaijani, for God's sakes. Look around. <laughs> that enough for you? Well, Jesus. Okay, I guess. We're live. You see anyone down there who might be an Azerbaijani? What do I know? You might be an Azerbaijan for all I know. Azerbaijan. <laughs> they look eastern. <laughs> Half this town looks eastern, Davy. You got the fall of the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. Make a call, Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. Yeah. Okay. Oh, my bad. I can't remember how to quick switch between the characters. I ain't gonna cut it, my friend. Shit, shit. I, 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 let me think. I... <laughs> Sorry, too late, <laughs> Trevor. Show Wrong up answer. God, Trevor is like at Disneyland right now. Free dental work. Ah, aren't you a lucky boy? This is my fear. No, 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 no. Ripping the teeth out. It's gonna show me, isn't it? I just it? have the blazer. Oh, did you really? Ah! I paused it on accident. <laughs> okay, that was awful. Not me accidentally pausing my game in the middle of it too. I was going a little too ham on my controller, I guess. 
So what have you got for us? Hmm? We need Trev to shake up your memory again? No, 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 he's got beer, he's got beer, he's got beer, he's got beer, uh-huh, I think you're making this up, no, no, I'm not, no, yeah, I'm telling the truth, bushy beard, okay, there are like two guys I think that had bushy beards, because that's all Mr. K's given us, no, you know, I'm thinking maybe we ought to just take two bullets and put them in our form, and just call an airstrike on Chumash Beach, get out the scope, yeah, so there's this guy right here, what am I looking for? Steve saying beard. What do you got? Anything specific or is some stubble gonna cut it? Let's start at Mountain Men and we'll work our way down until someone fits the profile. Well, there's a few beards at this party. Vinewood's full of weak chins. Place is famous for it. Damn. Beards are in fashion in Chumash. Land of beach hipsters. We need more. Great. It's just not it's gonna, gonna, gonna be cut a it. a long day until you give us some intel on our target. Oh, he's got beard. He smokes. He smokes like a fucking chimney. I don't know. Trev, maybe one more time. Just to be sure. No, please, no. I have a feeling it's the guy who, smokes. um... There's I a guy know. hanging out in the balcony area. Okay, this is the only one we haven't done, and I'm Do a little it. nervous. I'm a completist. If my mama had waterboarded me more often, I wouldn't be the gun-toting psychopath. Fucking hell, guys. This is hard what to get through. My mouth! I, I would drown! Vegas. Son of a bitch! Ow! I got blood in my mouth! I was wrong! Oh, oh. oh my god, guys! Oh. <laughs> I don't see what all the fuss is about personally. Oh. Oh. I don't want it, I don't want it. What if I do it too much? Aren't I supposed to? Okay, whatever. It's fine. I have, I've had my heart rate go above 200 before, and I was fine. That was terrible. I don't want to do that again. Enough. Just Hasn't fucking say something. Done enough for national security. <laughs> oh my god. Rise and shine! I'm still here. <laughs> that was scary. God damn. <laughs> Mr. K. <laughs> Mr. K. I don't know anything, please. Well, you better know something. Okay. I'm done doing this. And his left hand there. What's that? He changed smoke. And his left hand there. Ah. Oh. Okay, see, that's very specific. Any of these bearded guys at the party smoke cigarettes? Mr. K says he smokes like a pack of two a day. Redwood cigarettes? Thank you, Mr. K. Steve's telling me he chain smokes redwoods. It ain't the cigarettes that'll kill him. It's the guys who put the warnings on the packets you should worry about. And he's left-handed. Oh, now I get it. Oh? You're telling me to assassinate a guy because he's right got facial hair, a cigarette, and he's left-handed. But I'm that's not left-handed. I'm telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. The rest's details. How do I know if he's actually left-handed? Like, he could, he could be left-handed but smokes with his right hand. Right? Right here. Right here. Ah, I see someone. He fits the profile. Yep, fits it all the way. I got a good feeling. About as good as you can get while clipping a guy who probably don't deserve it. And now I'm taking the shot. Okay, ready? Baby, I got someone. Definitely a lefty. Redwood smoking, bearded, maybe. Maybe, Could it's a little be. dark. Used to be, Azerbaijani. Good enough for me. Steve, it's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friends. Excellent work to the pair of you. Now I got a racquetball game to get to, so Trevor, you take care of Mr. K. I don't I think, think that's set. the right guy. That can't be, right? Want me to do it? That was I too easy. He's outlived his usefulness. Oh, come on, please. shut up! That's a sport. Okay. Just get out. I'm done. I'm done. That was too much. Let's go. Come on. Wait a second, Mr. 
Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-Man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. Then what? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go. Get up. Come on, up the fucking stairs. Oh, fuck's sakes. You gotta carry him. Let's go. You're the babysitter now. All right. Now you got a flight to catch. Okay? Let's get you to the airport. In that condition? Oh, great. First. No seatbelts, though. If you're expecting seatbelts in this vehicle, you're asking too much. Hey, how's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? Kind of. Are you gonna hold it together? I want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 no. You have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning wood. I love them very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home. I can't. I'm taking you to the airport. You're going to get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country, and you're going to spread your message. I don't have a message. You're a torture advocate. Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We need it to get information, to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything. Exactly. Tortures for the torturer, or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times. We should all admit that. It's useless as a means of getting information. I'm feeling lightheaded. Sometimes you torture She's for bleeding the out, that's why. God. But only if they're prepared to pay. I am very unwell. It's me, 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 me with you. Jesus Christ, good grief. I thought we really bonded, but now I'm having my doubts. Departures. No one drives me to the airport. <laughs> okay. He's literally bleeding. Me. You're just gonna let him out like that? Run. You're free. Oh, what? But my family is here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here, all right? And look, trust no one, all right? You're alone now. Really? Yeah, really. Now let's go. Fuck off. Come on. Like what? His dick is bleeding and everything. And no, no one, no one cares. They're like, okay, whatever. And he just fell down the stairs. Is he okay? Can you go down there? Whoa, whoa, sorry. Is he here? Is this the one he went down to? No, I guess we can't see him anymore. I thought we'd like see him at the bottom of the stairs or something. <laughs> that would have been awful. Well, anyway. Hey, Uncle T, it's Jizzle, Jimmy. D2, the motherfucking S. So glad you are back. My dad has been acting like a wacko biatch recently. All angry and shizzle. Calm him the fuck down. Let's, I'm gonna, I have a feeling he's gonna say let's hang out. Yeah, let's hang out some time. I smoke a lot of weed now, and maybe you can take me drinking or something. <laughs> what do you make me for? A degenerate? You are like my kid. If my kid was a fat loser, which he wouldn't be. I love you. You must be good, like me. Less weed, more meth. You get stuff done. <laughs> oh my god. You're great for that. Yes, you are. So here's the thing. Let's switch over to Franklin again. Let's see what he's up to and we'll do some missions with him. I'm seeing that a lot of the missions Franklin had are also available for Trevor, so I'm hoping they do it together. Maybe? Skyscrapers. Trust me. Which one do we want to go to first? Well, I mean, the one by his house right here. Might as well. You were about to leave the neighborhood, Franklin? I'm putting you back. <laughs> we're going. Oh no, there's a van here? I don't like that. Ah, don't you step foot in this yard! 
Why? It's half my house. Now, I'm gonna call the police. For what? Disloyalty, boy. Disloyalty? What is you talking about? Don't act like you don't know what it is, homeboy, yo. You ain't been to the set, ain't came to none of the meetings. Mm, hanging out with old men, ignoring your homies, acting all superior? Your mama will turn over in her grave, boy. Mm -hmm. So you giving me a lecture about not being a good enough gangbanger? Gangs is positive. That's all we got, my nigga. That's our heritage. Ain't nothing positive about your crazy ass. Really, though? Man, where's Tanisha at? She got more sense than to hang out with your sorry ass. You know you always been like this, boy. I say left, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, miss. Yes! Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass Shut sister. the fuck up. Yeah. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Here, darling. Why don't you go get yourself something nice, okay? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Look at all those dollar it's, bills. Is this seven dollars? I was about to I say. Said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here. All right. You men are all the same. She's not wrong about that. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy. The boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dawg. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? I'm talking about the little stretch thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. Wait, I kind of feel bad. Stop. Y'all y'all want Trevor, I promise. He may be crazy, but he knows what he's doing. I'm tired of getting be nice to him. Where's this thing happening? Down Grove Street. Okay, let's do it. Hey there. Let's hit up Burger Shot later. We shooting shit up, spraying some motherfuckers. I can drive by with the best of them. Behave yourself, man. Lamar, what's happening? Trevor's just what trying to kill everybody. Up? We buying weight, homie. Something that'll move us up the food chain, nigga, for real. Not this real in this town, nigga. Particularly where you and stress concern. Man, this is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh! First rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging, either you got some dust? Fool wanna get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, homeboy. Homie's crazy, man. <laughs> so I've heard. Yes, he is. We love him, though. This is the homie house right here. Hey, look, everybody be cool, man. Lamar about to do his thing, all right? I don't trust Lamar doing his thing, though. If I'm going to be honest. Chops. Hey, point, this fool I love how Chops is with us. And he's so chill, too. Look at him. He's been a good boy. Courier service. Packers to collect. You got the grip? Present and accounted for. <laughs> you like that, huh? Sample? <laughs> now we talking. <laughs> Trevor's gonna be like, give me that shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now, you heard what your boy said, you're leaving. Hey, give me that. Oh, God. Back. Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask for a key or a fucking ounce? Man, that's motherfucking drywall. Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. <laughs> no wonder why your throat's feeling funny, Lamar. Out here sniffing drywall. Damn, really? Ooh, I'm about to. We're about to rampage, bro. It's over for you guys. Where you at? 
What would y'all do without Trevor, huh? Thank God Trevor was being greedy or else we would have never known we were getting played. Oh man. Here. They're too far. What else do I have? Let's see, what does this do? Ooh, nice. Oh, that's a friend. That's a friend. That's why I'm not going to shoot him. All right, I'm a little far. I guess everyone did kind of move up. Okay, they got it. Oh, shit. Who? Oh, you. I'm like, who is on the map right now that is alive? I don't see him right in front of me. This is actually really fun. I love shooting and playing as Trevor. Oh no, we have the cops on us. Now what do we do? Damn, okay, we're shooting the cops. Trevor's done this plenty of times. We're good, we're fine. Oh my god, all of the bullet holes in Franklin. That's actually kind of convenient that uh, we got this pathway here. Okay. What the fuck are you doing? Hell yeah, Trevor's gonna get the one with the girl on it. <laughs> That's so funny. There we go. Oh my god, yeah, we are like out in the open right now in the water. There you go, girl. Yeah, just jump out. We're not racing against each other. Goddamn. You gotta split? Crazy man, we moving. Come on. Get, follow me, all right? I'll get us out of this. Okay. Okay, we got this. Let's find a ride, homie. Yeah, we're gonna find a ride. Oh shit. Maybe I should uh. I guess I'm gonna have to uh, shoot y'all. Sorry, nothing personal. I just gotta really gotta steal one of your cop cars for now. Hey, Kent, if you can keep up, stay with me. Let's get with these cops, man. I guess more than this Shit, so we gotta go this way. At some point, we're gonna have to get a different car, I think. You got your authentic ghetto experience, homie? Drive by, running from the cops. Yeah, they've got it all. You should be a tour guy. Oh no. It's not taking me where I wanted it to take me. That's fine. Okay, they were gonna catch us anyway. Let me go this way. They aren't catching us, all right? We're getting away. Or die and try it. Shit. Yeah. I feel like spraying someone off the tourist trail. Oh, no, nah, man. This LF. Good or proper. Seeing as 
I prevented you from getting ripped off, I'll take my cut of the investment. All you gonna get is a cut of land. Let's get a different car that's not a cop car. Let's go. This way. Hurry up, Lamar. Oh, god damn it. This dude is being pissing me off. You're gonna die now. You realize who you just fucked with? Yeah, exactly. Come on, Lamar. That dude just fucked me up. There is no point of getting a new car now. I just thought it'd be less obvious getting a non-cop car, but whatever. Really? <laughs> Everyone's pissing me off right now. Getting in the way and everything. Oh god, this car sucks! This car really sucks! Oh my god, sorry guys! You're just kind of in the way right now. Okay, and then I'll turn right. I think I just stole like the worst car ever. <laughs> but we're making it work. We're making it work. Could be worse. Go this way. Oh my god. This is insane. We go. We're good. Oh, stop. You're acting like I didn't just save us. Real deal. Tell me something. What's that? Why aren't you like head to foot in green with the ballas like head to foot in purple? <laughs> man, that's old school, man. We don't do that shit no more. Oh, yeah? But how you know what side someone's on? Man, you just know. The ballers might wear a purple hat. Or like a shirt with some purple in it. Hey, man. Or maybe like a hat with a B on it for the ball of shit. And you know how we get down the families. We rock the Fuge hats with the Fs on it. You know what I'm saying? Or rock the green kicks with the green laces. Okay. Man, everybody already know who everybody is. It's just the law to say certain gang insignias make you part of some vast criminal conspiracy or some shit. They just want to hit you with that Rico charge. So, am I like families now? Oh. Nah, homie. You, you, you weird, crazy dude. <laughs> but he's helpful. He just saved y'all. Don't act like he didn't. Just drop me here, dog. Later on, crazy dude. See ya. See ya. I hope Chops is okay. Wait a minute. Chops probably just went home. That's what I'm gonna assume. That is what I am going to assume. I'm gonna steal a different car. And I guess we can go ahead and do like. They shutting it down. Hmm. I want to do like. Okay, I guess we can see Barry. Oh, we could do a rampage. Should we do a rampage? Hold on, I'm trying to. Now I'm really trying to figure out just what to do. There's a lot of things I want to do. T, how's Los Santos? We miss you. We really miss you. Listen, there's been all kinds of crazies sniffing about. That doesn't sound great. Did you steal my car? <laughs> I did, didn't I? Do you want me to bring it back? He's busy. Well, you're not getting your car back. Sorry, buddy. And yes, I did steal it. Hold on, actually, before we do like a rampage or anything crazy, I want to bring Trevor back to an ammunition. Whoa, hold on. What is this? Oh, uh, no, it must be an imposter or something. He's dead. I saw pictures of his funeral. I know. Why don't you come here and visit me? No, it ain't time for visits. Huh. Crazy. How you doing? Okay, ready? 
I need to get some armor. I also need to find some snacks. I have been told that snacks help. Um, to regain health. What all do we have for Trevor again? We have a lot. We have a lot. Yeah, he's he's pretty much set. For now. He's set for now. Hold on. I see snack machine. Can I get snacks from snack machines? No! Goodbye. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's just prompting me to use the shooting range. Guys. There we go. We can get a soda. Is that going to do anything for me? Can I get multiple sodas? Oh, he's going to drink it right now. He's thirsty. Oh, it actually refilled all my health, though. So there you go. And it was a dollar. It was a dollar. If I run into a store nearby on my way to anywhere, I will stop by and stock up on snacks. We are closer to Barry. But I'm going to do a rampage first. Because they're fun. This is Weasel News. Whoa. House party in Chad and Shanice Mulligan getting divorced. We're getting the drama. There totally was a train coming and I did not realize. <laughs> Okay, ready, guys? <laughs> I'm fucking up Trevor's car. I mean, Franklin's car. I keep mixing up their names. Hey, ese, que onda? Ese amigo, where you from, Bato? It's none of your business, huh? Okay? Hey, it's a slight accent. Fuck you. Hey, so I grew up in Canada, huh? Oh my god. He said, don't make fun of the Canadians. No, I'm not a motherfucker. Motherfucker is not his favorite word, is it? He gets really mad. I would get mad too if someone called me that, to be fair. Whoa! Oh my god, I'm... I feel like they're all gonna run me over again, aren't they? Well, they're on roofs? Whoa, what did I just do? I just set them on fire? Hold on, where is everyone? And now they're just running into everyone's cars. That's not very nice. Oh my god, they're like at every corner. I'm gonna reload. Oh god, where's the other guy? Oh, there he is. You're hiding! I don't know, this gun is actually working really well. I was, I mean, what else? Oh, I mean, it's the only gun we have. I forgot. We get grenades. I don't think I'm gonna need them though. Or should I? I'll do it. Bye guys. Smack talk me now. Wow, there's a lot of them. You think I give a damn about you Where are you guys? Out. There you go. Someone's behind me. Where are you at? Stop hiding. Not laughing now, are you? No, they're definitely not. I think they are very much scared. Oh, did I pass? I did! Wait, I didn't see what the... Okay, 45 kills was the thing that I need to be passed. I didn't even get six headshots. That's kind of upsetting. That's very upsetting. That's okay, though. Anyway, I'm gonna go now. Uh, you didn't see me. You didn't see me at all, actually. None of you guys did. I'm just gonna go over here. I'm gonna steal this car. 
Hey, loco, you scare me, but you kind of cool. We should chop it up sometime with Franklin or, or without him. Whatever, dog. Guys, should we hang out with Lamar? We should hang out with Lamar at some point. That'd be really funny. So we did a rampage. There's another one available now. And they're all very close to each other. I'll save that one though, don't worry. I kinda really wanna see what is going on with Barry. It, the mission was also available with Franklin. I don't know if it's supposed to be better starting it off as a certain person, but hopefully it means that we get to do the mission with the both of them. Are we able to reply with Brad real quick? Or to Brad? No, not really. She's just... Okay, then. Oh, Barry's the guy who does the weird weed stuff, isn't he? Holy shit. I was wondering. I was like, Barry does not sound familiar. Who is this guy? Yep, he's there he is with his table. Another doggy. There's a lot of doggies here. Can I get a signature, sir? For what? They're so cute. <laughs> the most important fight of all. Poverty. Hmm? No, another most important fight. The AIDS. No, no, no another one. <laughs> Animal welfare. Legalization. Here. Sign. Damn. Shit, where's my pen? Where's my pen? Legalization of what? Of things the founding fathers of took weed, a Trevor. A right Read the sign. To consume medicinal plants. Legalize smoke? Yeah. Yes. Are you fucking kidding me? I make a shitload of money selling that, all right? The last thing I can <laughs> handle is legalization. Now fuck He'll off. He'll be out of business. Take a drag. No, I don't, I don't, I don't smoke it anymore. It interferes with the speed. No, it, it's really good. <laughs> oh, in this case, it's going to be real crazy. This guy is pressuring everyone to try his shit. Yeah. It's a and that was a really big hit. Contemplative high that comes from you. <laughs> Those clowns over there. No! <laughs> they have guns! What? Oh no. Is this one of those hidden camera shows? Are these actual people that are running away? Because am I am I actually shooting right now? I hope not. Oh. They have a clown van? Do I have anything else? No, just this gun. Oh my god. I'm shooting through walls now. I guess I can do that. What the fuck is happening? I don't know, Trevor. I really wish I knew. And I'm really hoping that these random people running away are not actually people running away. No, I think it is all in my head because they're shooting the uh, civilians as well. Thank God. I was getting worried. I don't know why. This, this is actually less scary than the aliens one. That Michael had, for sure. I hate clowns, don't get me wrong, but these ones aren't very scary. Gosh, we gotta reload. There we go. They're very easy to kill, too. I think that's what it is. Oh, please! I don't need to get you. Oh, my God! Nope, that, you're not a clown. I'm so sorry. Very sorry about that. So I gotta shoot the van, too, right? Is that what's happening? <laughs> Trevor's reactions are very funny. Okay, the laughing is pretty terrifying, though. Where? I'm getting higher ground! You lose. 
Okay, I see you in a green suit. I'm not scared of you anymore. I'm a big boy now. He's a big kid. What is this? Two for one now? Yeah. Who's laughing now? I mean, they're still laughing, but it's okay. We're not going to talk about it. We're going to pretend like we don't hear it. Been really interesting Has he been like running around? What the fuck was that, huh? Why is he like Sorry. stumbling all over the place? Well, think about what I said. I won't. We really won't. Because I don't remember what you said. <laughs> that was great. That, that was really fun. Oh my god, he's still right. He's running all funny. Or is that just how he runs? No, it's definitely not. He was just getting back on his feet. Democracy can suck your fatty. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. I'm gonna need some random car. Get back here! Someone stop that guy! Who? The guy on the motorcycle? Sorry. Oh, Got him. No, I didn't. Got him. Actually. Guys, don't worry. I'm I'm saving someone. I'm gonna bring it back to them. It was meant to be. I can't believe you got that guy. We have to kill all criminals. There you go. I persuaded him to change his mind. Incredible, dude. You should keep some of that for yourself. Ah, don't thank me. And I'd by to that, kill them all anyway. I mean, I changed his mind. He had no choice. There's not a lot of great cars around here, is there? Should I just get a taxi? Wait, taxi, don't leave. I'm running to you. Um, okay, at some point, I actually kind of want to, like, dedicate a whole episode surrounding just pretty much driving a taxi. Just a whole episode where I drive people around in a taxi, and I think it could be, like, a really nice, relaxing, casual GTA experience. Hey. Maybe. I, I think it'd be fun. Okay, um... Yeah, I guess let's go up to the apartment. I think I'm going the right way. I hope I'm going the right way. I definitely am. Hello, I'm back. Trevor is the Trevor. Trevor is a is a what? Trevor is a what? Trevor is a good guy. He's got family. Got kid, and he's going. That's it, right? Yes, Trevor. But but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy, and um. And Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. Barry. But I'm scared that she's going to leave me. I mean, this is her place. And the fornicating? There's Mr. Raspberry Jam. Whoa. Whoa. Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam, <laughs> he died a noble death. <laughs> oh, my God. Bringing great joy to a lonely man. Oh, he's screwed up. I ain't got a very big penis. Some oh. girls laugh when they, when they look at it. So he's he's projecting uh, now. Show me. <laughs> show me. Boy. I, 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 I don't want to. Oh. Mine ain't nothing special, but this boy gets the job done. All right. Now, Wade here says that you work at the dock. <laughs> uh, yes. Look oh at me. Can you just put your Johnson away, sir? Oh, yes, yeah, that was full out. And? I saw it. Anything uh, <laughs> interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Oh, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down oh, there. Oh, God. To put these on. We... Going for a ride. Hell yeah, we are. Gentlemen, the gateway to America awaits. <laughs> I love to zoom in on him. Run. We got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm going to send you some information. I need oh you on point God. to help plan things. I got it, T. I really miss it. Okay, whatever, Ron. <laughs> whatever, bye. Oh, wait. Come on, get on. I cannot believe he struggled so much to get in the truck like that. 
Okay, Pier 400. Come on then, Floyd. What you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. You're going to have to be more exact in your questioning, son. <laughs> uh, we're looking for something to steal. Sir, I stole a pencil in elementary school, and I've been regretting it ever oh, since. Oh, God. He's, oh, he's too good. Kicking a bug. Uh, look, the sir... Please, or just tell me what you want, and I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. I don't know what I want. Right now. I don't know what <laughs> I want. It's a bit, well, like pornography or a perfect turn. I can't quite describe it, but I'll know it when I see it. You ain't aiding my comprehension. All right. I was about to say, I don't think that helps at all. $236 billion worth of cargo came through the port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. We don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put price tags on them. I haven't <laughs> noticed anything. Anything different? Anything that might indicate something? Well... There's been all these uh, Merryweather folks hanging around. Merryweather security consultant. Private army to the New World Order. My butt gone The folks now. waging outsourced His shadow wars gone in 20 numb. countries around the globe and recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil. That, um, sounds like them. So there's a private militia in yeah. the Yeah. What are they guarding? Something very special. Freighter? I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. A freighter. Perfect. Can I get on board? No, no. Uh, they won't let you anywhere near it. They're kind of assholes about it, actually. The other day, my colleague, Ralph... I don't give a shit about... We Ralph. don't need the whole story! We gotta take a look. Is there anything else? <laughs> There's another bunch of Merryweather guys out by the Navy warehouse. They got boats coming in and out. I heard they was testing something. All right. We'll take a look at that as well. See, that's very good information right there. You used your big boy brain. Go park and get the dispatch. No, yep, will do. <laughs> Go park and get the dispatch. Come on, shift the start. <laughs> I'm going the wrong way already. It probably doesn't matter. I think I could, I could have gone around, but. I can't even take a full hour lunch break. How's it going? Here comes the soup. Yeah. I gotta check in. Remember, Floyd, this can go real wrong real quick. I really hope it doesn't. We got a waste spillage and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. Hope you got a strong stomach, son. Yikes. Poor Wade. It matters what came out. What? He started getting weird about You gonna take me to see this freighter? Yeah, it's over here. You ever get helicopters coming in and out of here? And all those big sky crane things that can pick up a whole container? Now, this is restricted airspace. They won't let anything out of here without clearance. Shoot it down if they have to. Wow. Well, how's a man in a hurry supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that's stretched to 50 feet. Now, what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not going to move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner overpass. I just said they have the water surface real covered. Okay. That is the freighter I told you about. What do you think they got on it? Yeah. We just see the door. We ain't meant to know what's in the containers. But? But these are marked military. Government. That's some Anything scary business. Anything about that? The government stuff is hot freight. Pulls up, goes right through. This stuff's just been sitting here. You are beginning to arouse my <laughs> curiosity. Hell yeah. Over there, two o'clock. Looks like Forrest got on the wrong side of some Merryweather guys. Damn. You, you, we need two guys on the handler. A couple of containers and baby gotta be brought up to F. That ain't a question. Get on it. Now. We weren't asking a question. Damn. Okay, wait, what am I doing? Get up. We gotta do this. Okay. Oh, I see. I had to press triangle. I was expecting to uh, have to climb manually and then, you know. I guess they're gonna All that kick jazz. me out if I don't play along. 
How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scout the place. Oh my god. Place. We don't get the containers. They're gonna check your card. So oh, I'm true. I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. Yeah, I don't, I don't trust fine. Wade to do that. Boy's on a waste clearance crew. He's never happened when he's neck deep in shit. <laughs> They're gonna check us. Okay. Oh my god. I'm not gonna do this right. Those are the containers in Bay B. Almost there, almost there. <laughs> oh my god, this is really a process, guys. God damn. Is it not gonna straighten out on its own? I thought it would be easier and just help me, and it's really not. Look it there up. we go. Okay, we got it. Let's take her down to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers, because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating Stop, that's so funny. while under the influence. Yeah, no. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. Damn. Okay. There it is. Now I guess we got to get the other one. I'm going to need okay. a better view of that freighter. I'm sorry, but this is as close as you going to get. No, no, no. I need to take some pictures. Send them to my guy, Ron. Hell yeah. I need a proper view. There's the cranes, but... Cranes! Perfect! Oh, shoot. Hurry up, dude. Hurry up! Hurry up! I will run you over. <laughs> exactly. You didn't want to get out of the way. And now you're acting like you're all surprised that I almost ran into you. I think I got to straighten out a little bit more, though. This is a lot harder than it looks. <laughs> Swear. Okay, here we go. No? Please. There we go. Just don't. Don't what? I'm picking it up. I'm doing what the guy told us to do. I'm just doing it in a really slow, bad way because I've never done this before. It's kind of fun to drive, though. Okay, I can just do it on this closer one, right? Is it gonna count? They're so on to us. Yeah, because I'm doing if a really bad job. Done, I'm going up the <laughs> okay. Get me out of this thing. I'll drive us over to the crane and then I need to get off this thing. I'm doing a very bad job. Climb the crane. Oh, this is going to be scary. Hey, there ain't time to admire the view. I've been waiting on a crane driver nearly an hour. Oh, I'm not no. permitted to drive cranes, buddy. Hey, you need me to get your union rep up here right now? Sooner you get in the cab, sooner we can get out of here. Well, on you. here we go. We're doing a lot of shit today. All right, I'm here. What do I do? Oh, what? First up, position the cabin over a container. There's some lights on the spreader that should help with alignment. Okay, so like this one. That's it. There we You're go. In position. That's lined up. Move the spreader down so it can grab the container. Okay. It's hooked up. 
so lift it high enough to clear that container stack and move it to the other end. We need to go to the other end. Bay 5. Keep going, keep going! Damn, this is really hard. Oh god, I gotta lift it up higher. Oh my god, I gotta lift it up higher! Just a little bit, okay. I'm starting to tilt. Hmm. Here we are. That's the truck. Ease her onto it. You want to line it up with the frame of the truck. Um, a little bit like right here. Never any spit. Truck is clear to go. Very Single nice. Man and crane driver working together. Now let's do the same thing again. Okay. Take us back up to the other end. Got it. I was never meant to do this. <laughs> Get in position over the second container in Bay One. Got you. better at it I hope this is high enough I don't want it tilting again that was insane okay maybe oh no we gotta go a little bit more we gotta go a little bit more there we go Oh gosh, do I need to... Do I need to move it over a little bit more? What, what's happening? Did it work? All right. Okay. You're done. It did work. Wow. Ah, I mean, this is some view, ain't it? I'm gonna take a couple shots for my boy. Yeah, you are. Okay. Use the camera on my phone. The front of the ship. Like here. Take a photo of a guard on board the ship. Like this one. Take a long shot of the back of the ship. Okay, probably like right here is good. Send the images. I got you, boy. Um, why is he like all the way in the bottom? Okay, photo sent. To send the crane to the dock's floor. What? Okay, hold on. Where am I going? I hope I don't fall off. I'm a little scared right now. <laughs> Not trying to accidentally kill Trevor. Oh my god. And then I really just about almost did that. Stop. No, Trevor. I need you to go down this one, I think. Right? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Trevor, stop. I need you to walk forward. No! No! Thank you. <laughs> Go down! Trevor just loved the view too much. He needed to go back up one more time. Trevor, come on! I can take you over to the warehouse. This rig ain't being used. Okay, bet. Let's do this. Hopefully I won't get this crate disconnected. Here we go, we're good. It's on the other side of Port City. So they've been guarding one of them dry docks. We can take a look at it, but no one's allowed around there. Normal rules don't apply to us, Floyd. We're nope. going in. We follow special no, no. rules. The rules applied to me my whole life. I like rules. And look at you. You're a failure. You're in a loveless relationship. What do you mean? Loveless? Oh. I love Deborah. If she loved you. She'd be here, wouldn't she? But she's not. 
You know I'm insecure. You've got a dead-end job. What? Dead-end? No! Floyd, it's dead-end. Being a unionized well. longshoreman's one of the best-paying jobs in the world. That was entirely your fault! God damn it. Best paying jobs it's going too slow. You tell people around La Puerta that's what you do, they're liable to rob you. They're so jealous. No one's jealous of you, Floyd. They pity you. You're abused by that woman. You're abused by these slave drivers. I mean, I've never worked so hard in my life. It ain't so bad. Uh, I've been doing this every day for 10 years, only usually with less of the criminality. You're wasting your life. He likes Floyd. the familiarity. What we did. I'm Trevor. saving you from yourself. We ain't heard from Wade. What are you, his mother? He's fine. <laughs> I do, I do not believe he's fine. I really don't. Also, we are about to corrupt this man, and I feel hey, bad. Hey, hey, hey. You can't come through here. It's restricted access. No entiendo. Uh, no understando. Uh, manifesto. <laughs> manifesto say deliver here. Mm. Hey, stop. Where the fuck you think you're going? Damn. 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 I must have got confused. Uh, God don't speak English. Uh, must have just read the manifesto. He said, he said, no, Damn! Whoa! There's the distraction. Thanks, Floyd. Oh my god, you're letting him get the beat the fuck up. Jesus. No way. That's so messed up. That's terrible. I guess I will be going to his apartment. And he's probably gonna come back and it's not gonna be great. Trevor, these photos, you've really stumbled onto something. The ship, Meriwether. Yeah, 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 I know. Yeah. Tell me about the ship. If we put a man with a gun on the bridge next to it and get a guy on board, I think we got a good chance of taking over. Whoa. The way it looks to me, there's a container below deck. They're guarding it for the government. Keeping it off the books. Serious military technology, most like. Yeah, of course. I, I just found a manifest. They're testing something out at sea. It's got to be that. Now, get back mm. to work. The TPI conglomerate ain't thriving. There's only one man responsible. Of course, yeah. But I'll start pulling all the intel I can get on Meriwether at the same time. I, I got a file here somewhere. Thank you, Ron. Look at him being helpful. I feel so bad for Floyd. Oh my god. Wait, guys, do you want to hear? I got some crazy things to tell you. Um, and by that, I mean I'm gonna explain my dream to you guys because my dreams are just insane. And so basically, since I've been I've been playing GTA, like if not every day, every other day. So of course, like my mind is constantly thinking about it. So I had a dream that I was with Trevor and we had like this mission to do together and I literally I even had like the mini map in my dream like it was almost like I was looking at a s screen or like I was playing as the two of us and we were just going around I had the mini map and I saw on the mini map that we were supposed to go to this like kind of open field but it had a bunch of farmers on it and they were they were farming it was late at night and next to like the open field there was like this almost apartment complex type of deal. It was really weird. Don't know why they were next to each other, but we were gonna make it onto the farm. It was dark and we we're like, we got this. And then I see on the mini map, there's like a bunch of enemies. And like, I can see like their radar of their line of sight, basically like where they can see and what they're seeing. And so I was like, oh my God, there's too many of them. They're gonna spot us. So for some reason, Trevor and I, we end up in like this apartment complex right next to the farm. And it was almost like a stealth mission where we had to be really quiet or else everyone would start spotting us and like they would know we were there. And so we were sneaking around and we were walking very quietly. But in my dream, it was almost like it was impossible to be quiet. Our footsteps were so loud, so loud. It was like we were stomping around, even though we were literally crouched and we were sneaking. So there were like a bunch of different people in the apartment complex that found out that we were there and I was like, oh my god. And I guess one of the farmers lived in that apartment complex because then we like got out and we went outside and we were in like in the front. 
and one of the farmers was there and he was like listen i will not tell any of my boys that you're here trying to steal anything or whatever you're doing like i will not tell them you were here if you give me a bunch of money and we had no money so we were like we don't know how to help you and so the farmer was like well then you better get in that apartment complex and you better steal some shit so that i can get my money or else i'm telling everyone that you are here right now so the farmer walks away trevor and i are standing there and we're like okay i guess we got to go into the apartment complex and what's really funny is i remember as the farmer walked away there was like for some reason some like notification and like some prompt that popped up basically saying that the farmer is an available love interest for trevor like their relationship status was going up or something and it was like yeah like they can be together they can be lovers basically is what my brain was telling me and i know exactly where that is coming from i've also been playing dragon age origins on the side that was like the game i picked for myself um so that i have like a game that i can play on my own time outside of what i do on the channel and <laughs> that game is like very in-depth and it has like a, it has a really nice mechanic on character relationships and how you can build them um, Because it's very it's very like inspired by the whole D&D &D system, I believe So yeah relationships are very in-depth and I am currently trying to romance one of my companions in that game And I'm also playing it like every other day So I think GTA and Dragon Age were like in my brain And so it created this a dream a version of GTA in my brain and so I guess Trevor has the possibility of dating, dating a farmer boy and we were supposed to steal from people in the apartment complex to get money. I don't know. It was I had to tell you guys that because I was like such an insane dream. I woke up and I was like, what in the hell? <laughs> what in the name of all things holy? <laughs> I, I, I tried to stop it. You did? But it just kept coming. Oh God! Oh, it's, they're there, Wade. The they are ruining their apartment. For honest work, all right. <laughs> you, you, you get what you needed? Yeah, 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 yeah. More or less. Yeah, I just got to uh, figure out a place to plan this now. All right, this will do. Huh? No. That woman ain't even fine. Ain't no one understands. Why Floyd lets her use him so? That's, well, that's uh, insane. Low self-esteem, Wade. We got to build him back up. Now. And there, perfect. That was quick. Good shit. All right. So, based on my observations, I'd say these Merryweather security cocksnots are sitting on something real valuable. I think they got two of these things, but we only need one. First one is on that freighter in a container below deck. They got guards all over that ship, so it's likely they're keeping it on ice. The air, land, and sea routes into the port will be locked down as soon as we make a noise at these X's here. Which means we have to blow up the ship and grab the thing underwater. Oh my god. Need a guy to plant the bombs, a guy to look out for him with a rifle, and a guy to grab the thing, whatever it is, underwater. That means stealing a submarine, of course, but you can find us one of them, can't you? Huh? Can he? Now, We're talking about Wade here. Is off the coast being tested. They're running the operation from the dock where I last saw your cousin. We'll need a submarine for that too, and probably a chopper, a big one. We go out there, look around underwater, locate it, bring it back here, and find out what it is. Here? To the Congo? Aye, right, so, what do you think? Container ship or whatever's offshore? Hmm. I'm not even gonna lie, the offshore option just sounds a lot more fun in my opinion. Although I'm not really sure which one is supposed to be the better option if there is one. Offshore. Deep I don't sea know. Adventure. I think that'd be Gotta so fun. Be. I think that would be so fun. You and Floyd can help, and we'll bring along Michael and his unpaid intern. Nice. Okay. All right. 
What is that smell? Oh, we oh, are going no. straight to the local union rep. Wade here was injured in the performance of his duties. Human waste and it's has carpet. seeped into his very pores. And I am sorry to say this, but I don't think he's ever going to smell normal again. <laughs> you can't go to the union. You are union, all right? And you vouched for us, all right? You look at him, man. Smell him. Oh. Smell him. Ew. Oh, Trevor, Ew. Trevor. Uh, you're, you're planning a robbery on my place of work. You violated Mr. Raspberry Jam, and God alone knows what else. Not Mr. Raspberry Jam. Damn it, Deborah. Uh, look, my lady and my union, that's all I got. So why don't we just, uh, why don't we just let this all slide? Huh? If you're comfortable with what's happened to your cousin, then so be it, all right? But I would give him a bath and rinse him off. No! No bath! Why? You're a stinky boy. <laughs> Why have we not seen Deborah yet? Where is she actually? We're clearly here sometimes all day and night and she's just not here. So, uh, we're calling Michael. Ah, Trevor. Hey. Mikey, hey, listen, loving it here in LS, really settling in, getting my first enema tomorrow. <laughs> anyway, I heard about some action. Yeah, huh? Yeah, okay. Oh, you bet it's okay. <laughs> listen, I gotta do a little prep work, but so far it's looking pretty tasty. I'll need you to bring along that kid you've been hanging with, frankly. Oh, yeah. Oh, and how's your flying? You might need to take a few classes at flight school. Why would I need to do that? Trust me, you'll regret it if you don't. Gonna be just like old times, pal. I'm sorry. Some guys are just oh, to start the preparation, we need to go to flight school as Michael. I like that. That's actually, that's, that's a nice touch. Okay, they're clearly in the bathroom. That's really funny. You're getting wet, Lloyd. Take your pants off. <laughs> Take your pants off, Lloyd. No worries. Why get yourself all wet, buddy? Well. Yeah, what else is there? So we've got, like, some strangers and freaks going on. Um, We can honestly... We can end the episode with the strangers and freaks. Mission. I think that could be fun. And then... Yeah, yeah, we'll start with that. Oh my god, the freaking vehicle I stole is still there. I'm not driving that again. I'll take this car, though. It seems decent, right? Oh, look! I didn't even have to break in! The door was unlocked. Here, let's go to the Strangers and Freaks mission. And let's see what that is all about. Next right. caller, are you on the line? Hi, I'm calling from the San Andreas State Penitentiary. Dad? Is that you, Dad? Dad! Oh my god! Dad! Oh my god, every single oh no, who's time this? a guy calls an integrated health show from a correctional facility, sick, you think it's I'm your dad. He's you. not- Just give me the keys. Hold oh, on. Dad. Totally fine. Just had a couple of beers. What are you talking about? We had like six shots each. You. <laughs> Will you two just make out already? Seriously. Hey, can you give me a ride? Just so Boy Scout there can get his buzzkill badge. There's my car. Oh god, I have to drive, you guys? This is what I signed up for? I stole a really nice car, though. Hurry up, but walk faster! <laughs> so, where are we going? Not I'm on the cult place. Of uh, Howick Ave? It's not that far. Is it not? It's really not. Compared to the cult place, I think is all the way up here. That's very far. Oh, I don't feel so good. I'm not doing. Oh my god. I just got a mouthful of, like of something. Oh, please you don't puke. Take it slow. Okay. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna hey, listen. Thanks for this, man. As you can see, I could have driven. No problem, but Joy Killer back there had to lay a guilt trip on me. Can you believe he wanted me to walk? Walk? Who do you think this is? Europe? Just because I sound drunk doesn't mean my brain's drunk. 
you know? It's offensive. You don't call a deaf kid stupid for talking funny. I can't believe he just walked out without me. Why do guys turn into such assholes when they get married? Well, he can go back to his boring family to jacking off in the garage after everyone's gone to bed. I'll stick with my awesome life, thank you. I promise you're not as interesting as you think you are. Thank you, Trevor. Shut him down. This is nothing. You should see me on Thanksgiving pumping the turkey, shouting to you. You like my wishbone, don't you? Look at classic me. You sound Please like a terrible person to be down. around, buddy. All over me like a rash. I'd have cleaned up if I didn't have the worst fucking wingman ever. Uh be nice if everything stops spinning around. Okay, Tim. I want you out. I'm done. Thanks for the ride, man. You're welcome. I gotta get inside. Okay. I'm about to spill my guts. Take this for the gas. I'll see you around. Try not to pass out and choke on your sack. <laughs> yeah, do not choke on your puke. That would be unfortunate. But yeah, I'm taking your car. Goodbye. Wait. I seen a sub, Trevor, down at the docks on a ship called Daisy Lee. You could like snap the ropes somehow, or maybe they is some um, switch to drop it, Wade. Okay, thank you, Wade. Thank you, Wade, for being helpful. That is a nice car, and I kind of want it. Only place to get the kind of chopper you need is for to Zancudo, boss. So watch out for other hel helis in the area. Might be easier if you take them out first. Give me your car. It's really nice. I forgot Trevor does that. Thanks for the sweet coop, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is a lot better. Oh, damn, it's so fast. It actually drives kind of nice, too. Compared to other cars. I'm wondering what's- oh, sorry, bud. He really didn't, and I didn't see him. We're going all the way up here. I really am wondering what is about to go down. This is a house, right? Yeah, you can see this. Yep. They're doing yoga! At least I think that's the house. Actually, it could be any one of these. They all look the same. I can't remember what house it was that we dragged. This one! It's this one. Has to be. That's funny. Oh. Ooh, it's a nice house, too. We made it. Wonderful. A veritable treasure trove. That's a perfectly good sock and an entire cushion. What are you guys doing? Just ignore us. Yes, don't mind us. Pretend we're not here. Okay. You're not Jock Cranley, are you? <laughs> what? An artist. I love your work. Oh, stunt double. Oh, our favorite show. Mrs. Thornhill, snap. Watch the birdie! Oh, Trevor, just go along with it. to throttle me. <laughs> yes, yes, like you did on that, on that poster you did. Yeah, okay, all well, that would be my pleasure. <laughs> oh. uh, like that, huh? Yeah? Oh. Uh, uh, maybe something oh. like this? Or oh. like that? Huh? Like oh my that? god! Oh. Like that? Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, beat him up with that bag. Oh. Oh. Thank you. Mm, wow, that's quite a woman oh. there, huh? Oh. Trevor is, not, really is insane. We're, we're not, not worthy. worthy. We're, we're not, not worthy. I'm, uh, I'm not Jock, uh, what's his name? Cranley. 
Big star in the 80s. We well, love celebs. Oh. That's why we came to Tinseltown. Yes. Yeah. Before we met you, we were trying to break in to Bruce Spade's house and steal his rubbish. The things these stars throw away. They're not like you or me. <laughs> Mrs. Thornhill has the most unbelievable collection of celebrity underwear and bathroom products. This is so odd for that. You themselves. You guys have a great vacation, all right? I gotta go. We could do with some help. All this climbing over walls and rooting through bins. It's such a business. Nigel's got an arthritic knee. Yes. What do you, uh, what do you need? Just a few Vinewood souvenirs for my mm. museum. No, no, look, look, look at this map. I mean, a lot of these places have famous people living in them and some that are just hanging about. Bring okay. some things. I'd be... Very thankful indeed. Americans are the most wonderful people in the world, aren't they? The best. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, yeah. That is insane. Ah, uh, pair of fruitcakes. Pair of fruitcakes indeed. I want this car now. Was that all? His name is Nigel. That's hilarious. What are the um? Oh, this is the heist setup missions. Oh, and the other one is over there. Oh, yeah, another thing I was wondering about. So I know for each character, like, you're able to buy businesses for them, but I'm trying, I guess what I'm trying to figure out is which ones are actually worth getting, or is it worth getting all of them over time? Because a lot, some of them are affordable, some of them are not as affordable, and I don't know, like, which one would be, like, a good place to start, I guess. I mean, I know the hangar over here. Where was it? There was, like, a... Yeah, like, I think it, yeah, it's, like, this one. You can get certain missions and stuff and get more money. Or was it this one? Actually, yeah, I think it was this one. The hen house over here for 80,000. Like, there's a lot. There's a lot. Anyway, okay, well, I thought we were gonna go on and find some souvenirs already. I'm guessing they'll maybe let us know. Oh, wait, if you're able to get us some celebrity mem uh, mementos on your travels around the city, that would be marvelous. Some information gleaned from Mrs. Thornhill's magazines. There we go, see, there's the different locations. Actually. So maybe we should just do this now. Should we? So what does this mean? I have to... Oh. Nope. Locked. We can't jump over it? Oh, there's Could cameras too. Over. Yeah, I was about to say just climb over. I mean, there's like a camera right there, which is kind of scary, but... We're not going to talk about it. Whoa. Pill you gave me is wearing off. I've oh been God. watching you do laps for like two hours. What now. do I do? Uh, okay. Hey. Who the fuck are oh you? Oh no! They Yo, saw what me. What you you're doing here, man? This is private property. Just pretend I'm not here, kids. Okay, yeah. <laughs> He's crazy. I'm calling the cops. You are not calling the cops, okay? I was. I got scared and I just stood there. Are they still in the pool? Yes, they are, and they're standing around because they know I'm. A, I'm here. Where are the clothes at? How am I- are they in the backyard? Are they- they're in the house. Oh no, yeah, I gotta- I gotta like... I gotta put him down. I gotta put him down for now. Nope. <laughs> Sorry, dude. I'm just really trying to figure out where and how to do this. I think I need to knock them down. Does that make sense? But how do I do that? Because they're alert. Ew! He looks like a crackhead. You know what? Wear your clothes, bitch. Tyler deserves privacy, just like everyone else. Well, I took your clothes, so bye. See you never. Am I on camera here? That's so funny. Okay, bye. 
That's one way to do it. I guess. Um, now what? Hello, this is Nigel. Please be quick. I'm roaming in the United States of America. It's me and Nutcase. Oh my god. I picked up some clothes from your friend Tyler Dixon. There's even a skid mark. What fantastic news! Wait till Mrs. Thornhill <laughs> hears about this. Oh, she will be pleased as punch. I bet. I bet. So there's another thing over here. What, in the freaking... In the golf course? How do I even get in there? I don't know where the entrance is. Boss, you asked me to remind you about getting that chopper from Ford Zancudo. I know you haven't forgotten, have you? No, I haven't. I'm just too busy finding celebrity items for these old people. Don't mind me. So how do we get in? Am I not able to get in? I guess I need to find a way over? Or is it here? It's right here, I think. I'm just gonna cut through here. And we're gonna see what this is about. You guys are doing great. Brainless fool. Oh, they didn't like that. Okay, bye. <laughs> Trevor, why'd you call him a brainless fool? Oh my gosh. Steal the golf club from him? I don't think he's gonna like that. But I guess we're doing it. Hey guys, don't mind me. I'm just... Just gonna run to these group of folks over here. <laughs> Steal his golf club, no worries. There's a, se the there's a freaking security guard. Hey, you! Get up! What? Whoa! Okay, guys, it's going down. Can I shoot his, uh... Okay, well, I guess I'm not getting hey, that golf club. Where do you think you're going? I can't kill him. God damn it. I didn't expect that. I thought I could just casually walk up to them and it'd be like a whole experience. Like what? Now the cops are after me. Don't, yeah, okay. This is great. This is good. Good stuff here. Don't know a great way to do this. He just keeps, he's like drifting out. Sir. I'm trying to shoot his tires, you know? I don't think it's working though. A token of gratitude to your fans. It's time to give back, Mark. It really is time. Don't be selfish. Oh, he made it to the front. It's over. He made it to the front. Come on, Trevor. We can do this. Run fast! Oh, nice! I can grab it! Hell yeah! I thought I thought it was done for, and I, the cops aren't even on me anymore! Talk about that internship, okay? That's so she funny! Hello. Hell yeah! Thank you! Goodbye! That was crazy. I said it, Mrs. Thornhill. I, uh, persuaded Mark Fostenberg to donate one of his golf clubs to your Museum of Dysfunction. Oh, bravo! It will take pride of place on the wall above Jill von Krastenberg's pregnancy test. Okay. <laughs> Speak to you soon. 
I love Americans. You're all so brash and uncomplicated. Not the pregnancy test. I love how um Trevor always says that he persuades people to do things. When really he's either just killed them or attacked them in very terrible ways. Miss me! Missed you! Wait, which way should- Oh, sorry. I'm just trying to figure out where I'm going, folks. I'm gonna go down this road. For the next location! Oh, they have a Vinewood tour bus! Oh my god, isn't this the- This is the freaking jewel shop. Closed for refurbishment. I feel like calling up the designer and saying like, what the fuck? Hey, Gary, can I pet your pooch? I'm a big- What? Dexy, Dexy! What? That's your fault, you stupid bald prick! I gotta catch a freaking dog? Quick, go on, go after him! Someone call the bell! What just happened? Dang, how am I supposed to catch this dog? A part of me kind of wants to like, I think it's gonna take too much time trying to steal a car and follow him. Sorry, it's dude. It's a guy chasing a dog. What is it with you people? Doggy, come on, doggy. Be good oh, today. there he is. Gotcha, you, you little bastard. There, oh, there. he's taking the collar. Oh, this is weird for all of us. I want the car that I stole. I really like it. Chalk. Celebrity newsflash. Maniac steals collar from Carrie McIntosh's dog in Rockford Hills. Oh, how delightful. He's very good at that. Mrs. Thornhill will have me sporting that in the bedroom before the week is out. <laughs> oh, I, I, I joke, of course. I hope you are. We really can't thank you enough for all the effort you're going to to make our holiday so special. It is a lot of effort. Don't mention it. I always enjoy meeting people more chemically unbalanced than myself. Okay, I want my car back. I need my car back. Which I think should be right over here. It's gone. She's gone. That's a bummer. I didn't take it to the uh, apartment fast enough. I guess this one's gonna be mine. <laughs> I love Trevor looking around. He's gonna call the cops! Are you calling the cops? Okay, maybe he's not. Why is the car still going off? Stop. What? Wasn't there another location or no? For the celebrity stuff. Yep, there's a tiny little dot over here and I think this might be the last one. Maybe. Oh, this is such a nice house. My bad. Okay. Um, let me turn this way. Whoa. Guys, what are you all up to? Oh, that green car was really nice. But I like how fa Oh! Did I just run into it? Yes, maybe I did, but I want it! Actually, what is going on with the NPCs right now? I think they are all very much bugging. Give me this car! No! Let go of the door! Let me do my thing! So the next thing, whoops, is over in here. Is it in the back? In the back alleyway? No, wow, we had to enter the club. We get to go into a club. Oh my god. I'm excited. That's not the door. Is it this one? Yeah! I bet I could hit your G shot every time. You guys were amazing. Hey man, no more autographs. Hey, that's okay. I want something more personal. Piss off, you twat, before I kick your ass. What am I here for? Oh, I gotta beat him up. <laughs> I have to beat him up. 
Come down here, bro. Get to the floor. We're gonna make this real. I have to collect his tooth? I just had to no I had to knock it off. That's so funny. Oh, wait, that's a bathroom. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, we're all we're all just running out together. Okay, bye. You are a musical icon, and I just stole your golden tooth. How does that make you feel? How does that make you feel? Oh my god, this car's so broken. Let's head over to the uh, safe house somehow. Like, I think it's over here somewhere. We'll lose the cops along the way. Don't you worry, folks. Hi. Let's say my work is done here. Whee! That was dope. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go straight and then I'm gonna turn right up here. Yeah. Oh no. Um, right here. Go right here. <laughs> you guys got out of your car already. That's insane. Going under the tunnel. Bye. I should be good in here for a while, I think. Oh no, there is kind of a cop that's about to come in here, I think. I'll hang around out here. You know what? I'm gonna go back this way. How about that? I'll do a little switcheroo on you guys. Okay. There we go. Guess what, you crazy English fruit cake? <laughs> oh, I'm dreadful at guessing, aren't I, Mrs. Thornhill? No, she can't hear me. She's washing out a nappy from Samantha Muldoon's dustbin. Yeah, uh, oh one gold God. tooth, courtesy of Love Fist, complete with complimentary DNA. Marvelous, marvelous. Oh, Jock, I knew you wouldn't let us down. Toodaloo. Toodaloo. Nice. Okay, well, I, that's what I saw on the map. I don't really know of any other things for them, I guess. So I'm going to say that that was it. If I missed something, I'm sure I could probably, I don't know, find it later, I think. You guys can kiss. Just a truck and a coop kissing. For now, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode right there. We did a bunch of stuff today. This was like a longer, juicier episode for y'all. So I really hope you enjoyed. And if you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And hit that post notification bell to stay up to date on all of my GTA 5 uploads. And as always, I hope to see you next time.